morning. It is a uh, wonderful morning because hopefully <clears throat> this is the day I sell my car. I know I've been saying this for quite some time now, but it's looking like today might actually be the day. I haven't actually heard back from the guy since last night. He said he would send me a message this morning letting me know what time they could, he can meet. Hopefully he gets back to me. I just sent him a message to say like, hey, what's up? Because I'd like to actually meet with this guy. Man, I just woke up, so forgive me. But yeah, I'm trying to get this vlog thing down, so I'm talking to you guys right out of bed because that seems to be something you do. You start your day letting everybody know what the hell's going on. So this is me telling you that. <sighs> okay, so the guy hasn't responded to me this morning, so I'm not selling the car to that guy. My next option today is to just take the car to the dealership and take that massive pay cut. I mean, they'll probably give me like $3,500, turn around, sell the damn thing for like nine or 10, probably. It's an, I mean, it's a nice car, very low mileage and great freaking condition. So, I mean, there's no reason a dealership should have any problem selling this damn thing. There, there's our new school, the new junior high. And uh, that's where Caitlin and I met and had our first, uh, first love encounter. And there's a really cool fucking fire truck. Fire truck. <laughs> fire truck. Fire fuck. Fire fuck. Hello. I'm Brandon. If you don't know, I am one of the two bus bums. We are having a stressful freaking day. I'm supposed to drive to Salino, Ohio today, um, but the guy I was supposed to drive to hasn't answered me since 11:30. Um, so I'm not gonna drive up there without any kind of answer. Maybe that's him right there. Who knows? I'll see in a second. On top of that, our throwout bearing on the Subaru is freezing up, so Caitlin's clutch pedal is sticking in the down position, so it's on, and, so she can't take the risk of taking it to work. I mean, she could just get stuck on her way to work, so we can't handle that. Um, I suppose we do have roadside assistance, so she would be fine. Um, to get a tow, but we're looking to see if the throwout bearing is covered in uh, under our warranty. Because if it is, we'll obviously just use that. Otherwise, selling these cars is pertinent. Oh my goodness! Hello, you're so freaking cute. Oh my goodness! Oh, it's so cute. Look, we got ourselves a battery. Yeah. Wow. Do you want to tell them how, how nice the guy was? The guy was super nice. Did not have any used batteries in stock, which would have been 50 bucks, I think he said. Yeah, something like that. I'll call around to all of the neighboring stores that are relatively where you want to be, um, and I'll see if they have any used batteries. He called three different stores for us. None of them had the battery that we needed. Excuse me. Um, so he was like, well, let me see what I can do for a new battery. And he typed a bunch of stuff in the computer $70 and we were like after having said 139 yeah, we were like holy shit I was like bro yes yeah absolutely we'll take that price 100% I'll take it and he's like oh okay great and then we do the whole transaction and everything he's like oh you got the old battery and we're like oh we needed the core no. <laughs> he's like oh I ran it through with the core like you, you need that and I was like can we just bring it back and he's like no, I mean, yes, but like, no, that's not really how it works. And I was like, is there any way that we can do this? Whatever. He's like, I mean, I can take your ID. That man now has Brandon's ID. Watch out for stolen identities. <laughs> um, he knows and, where we live. Yeah, he knows where we live. And uh, we're going back now. I'm going to leave Brandon at the house to install this battery and get that car started. And then I'm going to go back and give them the core. Yay. I'm uh, returning it to its stock tune, and then I'm going to put the uh, performance tune back on it. I'm returning my vehicle back to its stock tune with this Bama performance tuner. Would you look at this? It's a beautiful car. I hate to see it go. My god, it is hot in here right now. Finally got ourselves a new battery, right there. Got the, um, I'm setting up a new um, engine tune 
or resetting my tune. So that's what the fan is on for, uh, because for some reason the uh, SCT tuner that I have, uh, my Bama Performance, is, uh, is it turns it on whenever it's uh, uploading its new ECU. Don't sit on the keys. We don't need a puncture. <laughs> right, yeah, I don't need a hole. It's going all right. It's rolling backwards, you think? Ah, it's rolling just fine. Since I've been growing my hair out, I've wondered what it'd be like to drive a convertible. It's gonna get real fucking annoying. You're gonna <laughs> love it. It's gonna suck. <laughs> Long hair down. sticks just a little bit. Oh, it does? That's the brake. I'm just as nervous as every other time I've driven this. <laughs> it's because you like this car a lot. Funny. So it's a five speed, so don't forget that. So just go all the way to the, it's, it's labeled right, right here. Right, yeah. All the way to the right and back. That didn't work. So it didn't roll. I got the thing on. I feel like I'm not doing this right. It's in. It's that's reverse. It doesn't go back over to the right and back into fourth. God, that's heavy. <laughs> You're on a hill. <laughs> I'm so bad. Well, no, you got it. It's way better than you've ever. You've way more confident than you've ever been. <laughs> I know. Don't forget, speed limit's 55. It's a five-speed, so yeah, you're in fifth. Stop there, yeah, I know. I told myself that as I put it in fifth. I said, don't you dare touch that thing again. I tried putting in sixth the other day. <laughs> Fortunately, it's a little more specificated than I am. Did you have fun? Yes. Was that nostalgic as fuck? It was. Oh my god. Are you really sad that this is going to be your last time ever driving it? Yes. Very. <sighs> so am I. Absolutely. <laughs> well, no, you got it. It's way better than you've ever... You're way more confident than you've ever been. <laughs> I know. 